Hi guys, so let's start with question number eight. It says that your coworker notified you that the node CKA node one is running on an older version of Kubernetes and it's not the part of the cluster yet. So we need to upgrade the node uh, to the exact control plane version and uh, also we need to add this node in the cluster. So firstly, we'll SSH into it. So you'll see. So serial version is 1.32.1. So next we have is we need to SSH into the node. Meanwhile, we'll open the documentation. Here we will take it to 1.3.2. Make sure you follow this documentation. Firstly, check the changing of the repository that you have. Next, you will run these commands. Next. This command 3.2 is the version that we have to take it upon. Choose ADM. Let's run this. Update the part over here, which is. 2.1.1 okay next it says choose ADM upgrade plan okay since it is not the part of the cluster so this will not be added as of now. We need to work upon the other thing, which is the cube kernel and kubelet. Make sure you run this command. It's just these commands you need to follow and make sure you also update the minor version over here, which is to 1.1 and this has been done now coming back if you see the cube ADM version and cube kernel version make sure you restart it first then check the version. Okay, so this is minor 3.2. Okay, done successfully. Minor cube kernel version. Yeah. So this is also updated. Next, next we have to go to the, this has been updated. Now what we have to do is we need to add the node into the cluster. So we have to fetch the token first. So just exit from here. And here you have to get so here the second part says that you need to get the cluster added into the cluster you have to generate the token for the same you will do a cube ADM 
टोकन क्रिएट आई नीड टू प्रिंट द जॉइन कमांड ओके सो जस्ट कॉपी द होल कमांड एज इट इज now just do an ssh again into the node and paste this command it says a uh, user is not running as root so just do a sudo for the same already exists so the node has been already added so let's check exit from here and just do a kubectl get nodes yeah so this has been added with the latest version and we have completed this question as well now we'll just exit from here and let's hop on to the ninth question